back everyone you may be in a situation where for some reason you keep getting this billing problem error with your specific iphone now the reason why this may be happening is because you either inputted a wrong credit card information kind of thing you can be getting an error like this or you might be getting an error like this i mean it could be one or two of these errors it's pretty much the same thing now why this happens basically you want to read through this specific error message it says there is a billing problem with a family member's previous purchase ask the family whatever to update their billing information so what we want to do here is we want to make our way over to our iphone settings right here we then want to go ahead and scroll up we want to click our name which is right up here so your name should be right there and right here under payments and shipping what we want to do is we want to go and click on payment and shipping now i may tell you to type in your password or something like that as you can see and when you do that it's going to take you straight into showing a bunch of personal information so you want to go and click here and it's going to go ahead and show you your you know paypal address or whatever specific method you use to actually pay for things so what we want to do we want to make sure we are using our specific method and we want to make sure our actual credit card information everything like that is legit within within the specific option now under media and purchases which is right here you want to go and click view account and we want to make sure that our same information is specifically set up too so right here under manage payments what we want to do is we want to click on manage payments and it can also take us to that same option as before and all we want to do is make sure that our credit card information and everything is set up properly as well now let's say everything looks good another thing i'd recommend doing is updating your iphone there can be a lot of times where a simple update can pretty much fix the issue and this is something that's you know very very common i'm not going to lie so we so what we can do here is we can go and click on general which is right here we can go and click on software update which is right there and all we want to do is go ahead and update our iphone to the most recent version of you know ios out there if it's super outdated sometimes updating it can possibly fix the issue as well and that's another thing you may want to do you also want to make sure you're you know connected to wi-fi or data connection and another thing you can do is to go ahead and force restart your iphone so hold down the buttons to you know force restart it power it off power back on and that may end up fixing it for you as well so those are a few different ways to fix it if you have any other thoughts or questions let me know in the comment section below hit the like button that me so much but definitely hit that subscribe button more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll get you guys in the next video peace out